Now to a local 10 News investigation into what's rocking a quiet Dania Beach neighborhood. Families say the noise is even louder than neighboring Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport. Local 10's Andrew Perez live with what he's uncovered. Andrew. It's incredible. Residents say there are times where they can't hear themselves think, where they can feel the vibrations coming from cleaning, coming from testing being done at this plant here behind me. And they say temporary or not, it's not a way to live. Sometimes they turn up, I guess, upon power demand. And when it turns up, you feel it. Residents shaking in their sleep. Laying in bed, it doesn't matter. You put earplugs in with a pillow on top. The entire house vibrates. It sounds like there's an airplane or a subway. I got to yell for you to hear me. It gets so loud, in fact, you can't even hear planes flying low headed to Fort Lauderdale nearby. It's FPL's new clean energy center, and crews have started running tests and cleaning with steam. What that means for area residents around Dania Beach, though, much more noise around the clock, something they hadn't experienced before. Listen, we bought here, we knew there was a power plant. Uh, the noise in the previous plant wasn't as loud. Not continuously and definitely not as loud. Residents say all the steam and buzzing has been running at times 24 hours straight. Stacy and Lewis Toll closed their shutters, but that hasn't done much. Other residents around Griffin Road and 441 can hear it while they sleep. It sometimes cranks up and down. We're seriously thinking about getting better windows now. The city of Dania Beach telling us it's been in constant talks with FPL and says this process is only temporary. The plant expected to open in June and this process should last until February 18th. But for residents who've struggled to sleep so far through this, they don't know if they can or should put up with nearly three more weeks of sleepless nights. I'm at a loss. I'm at a loss. We're considering um, getting an attorney. So the city of Dania Beach telling us the plant can open, frankly, without going through this process. FPL sent us a statement a short time ago that says, in part, it is, quote, looking at additional options to help mitigate the effects of noise as we work to complete all the testing. We'll keep you posted on what happens. That's the latest here in Dania Beach, though. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.